Hello again everybody, I am Jesse Ladner and on this video today, well, as you thought it would be, I thought you thought I was going to be live streaming my NASCAR Heat 3 Let's Play, well, I did, but I kept messing up the intro, well, because I'm too half awake. Anyways, I just want to show you something here, because I'm going to have to postpone the live stream until another time, because I'm too half awake, and I mean, I've only been up for an hour. Anyways... Well, here's an HP laptop. It's not mine. It belongs to my uncle. Well, he's in jail right now and probably not getting out to the next coming years. This is the HP Touch Smart TM2. Got Intel Core i3 in it, Windows 7. Mm, looks in decent condition, but it's actually got a problem to it. I was working on it last night, but I never did video it because it was late. I'm just gonna plug this up real quick and show you show you what's going on with it. I know it's got a dead CMOS battery because last last night when I plugged it up, that orange light was flashing for a bit. So I gotta fix the CMOS battery because I think it's dead. I'll just show you um, before I turn it on. I'll just show you the side of it. Oh, there's a charging port. You got two USB cables. Um, don't know what that, that must be a sensor for something, and not sure what that is, right there, maybe that's for the screen, something to do with the screen, there's your SD card adapter, your uh, Wi-Fi adapter on and off, I guess, and there's the power switch, and as you can see, there's no CD drive. There's your headphone port, another USB cable, HDMI. Um, right here, it's got the, the VGA adapter and it's got Ethernet right there. Just like that. So, I mean, it's really a nice laptop, but, but like I said, it's got problems to it. It'll power on. As you see, now I'm sorry the camera's not focusing right, but there you have it. There's the hard drive error. Now, I could do a system diagnostics, which is not going to do any good. When I hit enter, it didn't used to say that. I, I unfortunately messed something up last night, but all it would say, um, I can't remember exactly what it said, but it didn't, it wasn't saying that. Like, I was in the middle of trying to recover it. Because I think the recovery partition on here still works. But um, the problem was that hard drive lag I kept on blinking. You see the rhythm on my finger. So, and I think it wasn't reading anything. So, now I'm going to have to reinstall Windows. Can't do nothing about it yet because I still got to get some stuff ordered on Amazon. But, um, so yeah, there's nothing else I can do about it. I'm just going to turn it back off. Really nothing else to do about it until I fix the hard drive. Now, if the Windows doesn't install correctly, then I'm going to have to um, gonna have to take the hard drive apart, which I don't have the tools to do that. Yeah, again, i got to order some stuff on Amazon. But it runs a... Uh, I don't want to show the product here or anything like that. Uh, but it runs a Windows 7 Home Premium. That's so yeah. Does need some cleanup to it, and I don't need it. I don't know if I'm going to keep it because my uncle ain't getting out of jail for the next coming years. So don't ask why he's in jail. Don't ask that. Don't because I, I really don't know exactly why. Anyways, let me come over here real quick. Because I really thought when I made I made a copy of this to the CD, which I really thought it was Windows 7 repair disk, but no. Unfortunately, it was a Windows 8 repair disk the whole time. I just never thought about labeling it. And in order to create a Windows 7 repair disk, you have to have installation CD. Well, I don't have that kind. But that's what I did. Here, let me pull the CD back out. Here's what I did. So, I put this CD... Until into that computer right there, the Dell Ultraplex 780, 
and I had copied the files off of that to this SD card. Well, it's a USB SD card adapter because that computer doesn't have an SD card adapter itself, so it's USB SD card adapter. I just copied that SD card and put it on there, which was no luck. It didn't do any good. It kept doing the same thing. But like I said, it didn't used to say, um, boot manager is missing until last night. I tried it. I messed up something. So now, I think what happened was it deleted the whole, the whole Windows partition, and now I'm going to have to reinstall everything. What? But like I said, I'm going to have to get another Windows installation CD, which I'm going to have to order that on Amazon. I mean, I do have some recovery media, but it's only for Windows 8, and this is not a Windows 8 laptop, it's a Windows 7, so. That pretty much screwed, isn't it? Oh, well. Alright, well, this this project is going to gonna be continued at a later point, probably next month or something like that, whenever my mom has money to order the stuff on Amazon. Well, I mean, I had a hundred dollar gift card, but something ended up happening to it, and there's nothing else I can do. Nothing else we can do about it. We tried contacting Amazon. There's nothing else I can, we, they could do about it. So, I got it for my birth. That gift card I got for my birthday last uh, last summer. Oh well. So, like I said, that will be that will be continued on a project. That project will be continued at a later point. And I'm not live streaming NASCAR Heat 3 today. Like I said, I'm too too much, I'm too half awake to do any of that today. And I didn't wake up till like an hour or so ago. Well, that's it for this video. Like I said, it'll be it'll be continued at a certain certain point. Not much else to say, really. And I'm short of, I'm kind of, I don't know, I'm kind of short of breath now. That's weird. Anyways, alright, well. Like I said, once I get all the required stuff for it, I'll try to fix that up. And if, and if it doesn't work, I'm going to take the hard drive apart, fix the head, and see if that works. If not, then that hard drive's done for. Because... Like I said, the reason why it's saying boot manager is missing is miss mi missing because I think in the middle of recovery it had froze up. It froze up when it was in the middle of recovering, and I think it the Windows partition got deleted. But I, and I'm not joking. Like it was the hard drive light was just flashing like this, or yeah. So I think it wasn't reading anything anymore. It got about sixty or so percent. Recover, and that's when it's the hard drive light started flashing. So, I think that hard drive, it, it, either the hard drive is locked up itself, or Windows just needs to be reinstalled. It's one of those two, but you just never know. Just never know. If if Windows doesn't install properly, all right, then it'll have to go. Go. It'll have to be more complicated, and it'll have to. Take the hard drive apart, which I never done before. It'd be my first time trying to fix the hard drive itself. I saw a video of how to fix that. The head gets pulled whenever it's been forced shut down so many times, and it gets and, it, and when it gets pulled too much, or it throws the um hard drive error. I think something like that. If you get what I mean, I think that's how it works. When the hard drive head gets pulled too much or it gets tight I don't it just throws the hard drive error that's it's pretty much something similar that happened to my uh, I can't remember what model it was on my HP laptop I got it for Christmas in uh, 2012 well the hard drive well I do have a picture of me if I do ed if I do edit with my computer I might put the picture on with it but anyways, um, I had a picture I got for me from Christmas back in 2012 when I first got the laptop. This this a different laptop is what I'm talking about here. Keep in mind, the hard drive had crapped out on me. Um, uh, I think two or three times, and the third time there's none I can do about it because it was 
Was it? I can't remember. It was like set two or three times to where the hard drive crapped out, and there was nothing we can do about it. Geeks, it was out of warranty uh, uh, over Geek Squad. That bulb just flickers. Gets me sidetracked. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't even know if I'm gonna. I don't even know if I'm gonna put the picture of me with, when I first got my laptop. I don't even feel like turning this thing on, you know. Sorry for complaining, but I can't help it. I'm so I'm half awake so much. And I know JK18 is going to probably hate me for getting off topic, but. I know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Jay. I can't help it. That's what, happen that's what happens when you have ADHD. Your mind just goes really crazy. Stereo over here. What a radio kind. The weekly required test actually went off around midday, 11 a.m. Because that happens every Wednesday, between 11 and noon every Wednesday. If there is a dread of severe weather, they'll be postponed until the next fellow good weather day. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, there's an Xbox computer. Somewhere there's a PlayStation 2, which every once in a while I'll play it. Okay, I'm breaking the topic so much. I know Jay's going to probably hate me now. But, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end, end this video here. I will continue my Let's Play the live stream, NASCAR Heat 3, sometime. Um, but, I, just, I was planning on doing it today. I, I had canceled the live, I had stopped the live stream because I kept messing up. I was just too half awake. Alright, well that's it for now. Like I said, the project will continue on that laptop at a later time, whenever I get the stuff ordered. So yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit like, make sure you subscribe, and we'll see you on the next video.